Hi, this is a quick video for Viacoin. Thank you very much for all the um, all the tips, all the names. It's really giving me a few ideas. Hopefully, I'll be able to publish all of them. Um, so, Viacoin is something that I'm looking at here. Um, this was mentioned by one of the subscribers. I forget your name now, but thank you very much. And just so you guys know, when I an analyzed Verge. Digibyte and BitShares, all of which have gone up a bajillion percent. Um, initially, that was all um, from you guys, so it was you guys who were asking me to anal to analyze it. Hence, I made the video. I've only been doing this, as you know, for six weeks. Had I got into this market six months ago, I'm sure I would have made you all billionaires by now. Um, but hopefully, you can become millionaires. So you might have to wait another bubble for to become billionaires but um, so I'm just going with the flow really I'm just uh, analyzing whatever you guys um, you guys sort of know and you know you guys know much more about the fundamentals than I do just looking very quickly what I like about Viacoin it's been around for quite some time so it's clearly it's not one of the new stocks the longer it's been around the easier it is for me only because I've got a lot more to analyze I mean look at this 2015 can't remember the last coin I had a look at that was actually going far as back as this 2014. This is almost like Bitcoin. It's been around for as, as long as Bitcoin has. And if you have a look on Coin Gecko, from what I've been told, I'm not sure how accurate this information is. Anything around 50% is supposedly meant to be good. Um, however, as I said, this is just from what I've been told. Um, obviously, things like you know, I don't know, Verge. Let's have a quick look. I don't even know what Verge is. Um, it's 72%, but I'm sure Verge was a lot lower than that when I first had a look at Verge. So I wouldn't look too much into this. I mean, some of the smaller cap stocks will obviously be a lot lower, but that's just giving you some sort of guide. If someone would like to comment on the accuracy of Coin Gecko, um, please do. And let's just have a look at Digibyte for a laugh. Um, that's 63%. Okay, and obviously Bitcoin, I presume, is going to be 100% or whatever. 91%. Yeah, so, you know. Clearly, you know, Ripple, whatever. So clearly, the the good, the supposed better coins are higher scores. So anyway, um, that's that's just something to have a look at. So that's just one of the websites I've been using the, the last couple of weeks. Um, but anyway, what I like about Viacoin is that it's been around for some time, okay? And this is this is going places. This is hundred percent is going to go higher. I mean, I've got a target here. This is on the Bitcoin uh, exchange, by the way. Um, Keep on getting told off by you guys for doing the USD, which makes sense because you are trading it against Bitcoin. So why would you want the USD chart? So that is a fair point. So as a minimum, you're gonna make 528%. Okay, it's well. Let's not go that far. Let's just give you the initial target. Will obviously be the previous high here. So let's just let's not jump before we uh, run before we can crawl. Yeah. So 275% after which point I expect 524. Now what I like about this, this, this is real accumulation by the big players, okay? It's come down in an ABC and that's the initial spike. This is the rounded bottom. This is what we like to see, okay? Verge did the exact same thing. Bitcoin did the, did the same thing. Any coin which accumulates like this over a 2015, 2017 period, that's big boys getting in. So you can guarantee after the crash, Viacoin's going to hang around. So I have no idea about the fundamentals, but I'm sure they're good. Um, I'm sure one of you guys must know. Um, but that's 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 real big players getting in. Then it makes a little cup and handle, whatever saucer, whatever you want to call it. But that's that's real ac accumulation. Now that, that's not you know Viacoin's not pissing about here. Um, so. That's that's what you have. So you got an ABC going into a cup and handle, rounded bottom, and that's that's you know stage two accumulation by the big players. And then you got a one, two, three, four, five, and basically since well 19th of June, it's been absolutely hammered. Anyone who's been holding this has been absolutely hammered. 88% um, hammering, and as you know, I like my triangles, but I also like stocks which have been absolutely hammered. So right now. It's starting to move up, so this this is a great time to buy Viacoin. Um, so thank you for this, whoever the sub subscriber was. Um, I would start initiating some sort of position now. Let me just so that's the macro scale. So if all that's an ABC, this is a one, this is a two. Obviously, we're gonna get we're gonna get a crazy. I mean, I think January, February, March for all coins are gonna be ridiculous because we're going to see the dollar collapsing, gold going up and inflation coming in um, and it's likely the Fed's going to raise interest rates. Um, 
as we all know, inflation is bollocks. It's just a um, a tax because uh, they call it inflation. It's just really devaluing the uh, the currency, which has been happening since 1913, thanks to the Federal Reserve for that. So um, there you go. That's how you're getting played. Um, and anyone who calls Viacoin or Bitcoin fake money, unfortunately, that the dollar's just just as fake. Um, I'm not recording this. It's just slightly less fake. Um, and the reason inflation is going up is because the bond bubble is uh, the bond market is collapsing. So um, that's kind of things that they don't like to tell the average person. But anyway, f forget about that. This is not a gold video. Um, so yeah, it's um, sorry. I didn't even finish what I was doing then. Um, so yeah, I'm liking Viacoin, real hedge fund accumulation here, real accumulation, no, no pissing about, you know, one, sorry, let me just, so basically this is all a bigger degree one, if we say, so yeah, so that's a one, two, three, four, five to make it a one, so let me just make that a larger time frame, super cycle, whatever, so that's is what Viacoin's doing, it's been, in this nasty little downtrend, and now it's ready to go up, so you could say three is here, four is going to retest and then five is going to go higher but let's not project higher targets initial targets are definitely here and then definitely there um so via coins are really good buy and as i said i think january february and march for altcoins um almost regardless to a certain extent which one you're in is going to be bullish so anyone who's watching this video after january the third i feel sorry for you guys because um I advise you guys to get in on altcoins. Stay away from Bitcoin. Just get into the altcoins. Um, and get ready for a interesting 2018. Um, it's going to be one to remember, definitely. So, as you can see, it's getting hammered. A, B, C, X, A, B, C, A, B, C. There's loads of little shitty little A, B, Cs. Yeah, you can. This, is, this looks like a bit, bit like a wedge pattern, actually. Yeah. So you got a little wedge here. You got a wedge there. Okay, and what's happened recently is, man, I wish I'd have did this video ages ago, because, um, so what's happened on the 20th of December, it's broken out of this wedge, this long-term wedge pattern, um, and that's interesting, that's interesting, okay, uh, so let's just have a look at the retracements. So I think the low was about there. Right, so you're going to get some resistance um, here at the 61.8 retracement of the whole wedge. Okay, so that's that's quite normal as well as the top of the wedge, which is here. So you'll get some resistance here, obviously some at the new high, but then it's just going to power all the way through to this target. So Viacoin, for those of you who have not been in it, is 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 looking good so yeah th this actually broke up as i said it's impossible for me to keep a track of all these these dumb things but anyway let, let's take the wedge off so let's just show you this in a little bit more detail um so basically this is the start of an impulsive pattern on a shorter term time frame yeah so you got a one your two is here then you got a one two three four five three four five extended five now what is interesting is it's come down to here already and it's gonna go up so you know there's an argument to be made do you buy in now um, or do you wait for it to retrace a little bit lower okay as I always say to you guys you shouldn't get too clever with these things everyone's buying them so the retracements can be too shallow but basically after a one you're gonna get some sort of ABC to make a two then you're gonna get a larger degree three four five yeah so either way it's definitely going up, but short term, it may go a little bit lower, but I wouldn't get too clever with these sort of things. Um, if you're willing to hold long term, um, quite possibly you should buy in now or just wait for it to come back down. Now, what I will say is on the 15 minute chart, um, what I didn't like was this. Now, that could be an A, B, C, so it could very well have, yeah, see that's, that's the thing. That's the thing. What I found with with these coins are they make these really not very nice looking wave ones. They make these ending diagonal wave ones um, that aren't nice to look at. Three, four, five. But they are technically leading diagonal wave ones. Um, in any other market, you wouldn't see this. Um, 
So that's just what I'm saying. This might very well have been the low. If not, it's retracing back down and you might look at wanting to start a position at some point over here. So it's, I'm a little, little bit unsure only because um, this might very well be an A. So um, if you start that as a 5, that might have been an A, that might have been a B, in which case this is a C. That's very clearly a five leg pattern, okay? But then this is where Elliot becomes a little bit tricky. Is that the end of the correction or is that just a larger degree A? Hence, is all of this ABC a larger degree A? Is that a B? Now is it coming down in a C, okay? So that's obviously going to be a larger degree than the other count. So I hope that makes sense. So is this ABC part of a more complicated correction? or has the low been here and is this just an ending diagonal B? Um, there's no way of knowing if this is actually a wave 1 and not a B wave um, it should retrace between the 50 and the 618 um, which it already has done here so you know difficult one really difficult one if it was me because I know it's definitely going to go a lot lot higher I would at least initiate some sort of position um, here and then if it retraces against me I just buy more buy more buy more till it falls down then it goes it's going to go back back up again some of you guys a lot of you guys are not patient unfortunately and so you want instant gains but that's not what trading is trading is not meant to be exciting it's meant to be boring um, it's not gambling okay so that's that's just if this is actually a wave one and not a B wave you would expect it to come down to the 50 to the 618 which it has done so we'll have to wait and see how Viacoin plays out um, you know this could be just a larger degree A this is a B in which case it's going to come down in a C wave okay so you know we know the C wave has got five legs so is it the case that this is just a wave one this is all a two it's going to do a three some crappy four and is it going to do a five end up back here then is it going to double bottom with this and then is it going to go up that's one option or is all of this a wave one this is a wave two and now it's getting ready to make a wave three okay certainly any break above this level here um, 31,000 satoshis or sats as you guys call them um, if it's a break of 31 sats I'll definitely be setting up buy orders above this level here because that means you can't be in a C wave down you must be in, a, in an impulsive leg so this is where Elliot gets a little bit 50-50 okay it's not 100% you need to always have the alternate count but for those of you who are patient it doesn't really matter um, you could just buy in now and you know a lot of you guys aren't comfortable holding negative positions but I am so if, even if it goes on another 20% I don't care because I'll just buy more in here so that's a good thing about keeping cash on the side so anyway let's not boil too much down into the the Elliott wave because I'm getting a headache so um, but that's just your possible count if you had to push me on what I think it is uh, I'd say this is probably an ABCA, this is probably lots of little ABCs to make a B wave and I think it's going to end up coming down a little bit, maybe maybe to the 618, maybe to here, maybe to here, yeah, and then what you can do is get this little fella here and there's usually a, a correlation between the A wave um, and the B wave, yeah, so it's usually one to one. So this is now shaping up to be a possibly um, an expand um, a regular flat. Okay, so we know a regular flat is basically this, yeah, A, B, C, yeah, um, and that's a regular flat. So the B wave hits the top of the A wave, and the C wave ends up going here. Expanded flat is this, and running flat is this. Um, so that's my suspicions but anyway we are on the 15 minute candles here right so you know anything could happen in the short term but I'm looking definitely to set up a, some sort of position um, some sort of position in this sort of area here I wouldn't get too clever with this and any break above 31,000 sats certainly 33,000 whatever that number is sats it's gonna go up because what you're gonna get is 
a quite a ridiculous move up to be honest um, because if we're saying all of this is a major wave one it's now pissing about to make a two it's going to go up into a three and as I've said a thousand thousand times I feel as though I'm repeating myself every day to be honest because there's so many coins so thousand times it's wave three which is the killer leg okay so for those of you like myself who missed this move here it's a good time to at least start a small position maybe 10 20 percent and then as it starts to move up quickly get on the bandwagon and then just ride it all up and for those of you who are more longer term and there are many of you and I reward you um, you could just set up a position doesn't matter if it goes against you it's not going to go lower than this and just ride it all the way up because um, definitely liking via coin um, definitely like a via coin so and it's all because of this this is real hedge fund accumulation if you were to have a look at the big stocks the ones that accumulate like this they end up making really big moves and Verge did the same Bitcoin did the same and I really like to, to see this and it's been around for like three or four years so Viacoin is not going to go anywhere this is only going to go higher um, but as I said for, for those of you who are impatient and short term um, you know there is an argument to be made short term it could be going lower but who the hell cares it's going to go higher so thank you to the subscriber who's mentioned Viacoin as I've said, if there is anything you guys want me to look at, just leave it in the comments. Um, more recently, I'm getting into stocks that are less than 100 million market cap because I feel as though that's the where the, where the value is. However, Viacoin is clearly an exception, although it is 90. Um, but Viacoin is going places, definitely. Um, you're getting this at a very cheap price. Anyway, I've gone on long enough, so thank you for that. I said we all help each other here to make money that's the way it works um, and yeah I think the first quarter of 2018 is going to be quite prolific for altcoins um, you're going to see something special starting 3rd of January alright see you guys soon